What's good YouTube, Psycho back with episode 2 of our Pokemon Red version enhanced for the emulator. Uh, when we left off episode 1 with um, our level 12 Bulbasaur named Seth, who currently has Tackle, Growl, and Leech Seed with pretty good stats I'd say. Um, homeboy's got Leech Seed, needs a grass type move for that stab, but you know that's about it because I don't think I can take on Brock without... Um, at least a stab grass type move or a different Pokemon from here. So we're gonna have to see. I don't wanna pick up a Rattata, dude. I just don't. I just don't wanna do it. Alright boys, so this episode we're definitely going to take down Brock and we're going to explore some, if not all, of Mount Moon. So that should be, uh, it's on our list for stuff to get done today. Probably not all of Mount Moon, to be honest. That's a lot, that's a lot of content to get through. Alright, I'm not exactly sure how many Pokeballs I have on me at the moment, but I'm sure this will be enough. Can't go that way until I defeated Brock. Can't defeat Brock until I have a stab. Grass type move. That's great. All right, here we go. I just really hope I find something that I can use on the run, you know? Not that. Maybe I should have caught something in that, um, a side route next to the Pokemon League. All right, and I, I'm not 100% sure, but I think level 13 is where um, he's going to learn uh, Bind Whip. At least I hope he does, because, man, uh, my life's going to suck if he doesn't learn Bind Whip very soon. 14, maybe? I hope it's not level 14. It's been so long since I played Gen 1 in general. I, I never play Gen 1 games. I always just play, uh, I never play Gen 2 either, but Gen, if I'm going to play a game in that kind of format, the, the Gen 1, Gen 2 format, it's going to be Gen 2, I think, just because I like Gen 2 more. Man, I, I don't know. I don't know about this. I mean, I need something. Instead of just Pidgeys to grind on. Alright, still no. Another Pidgey. Uh, and that's just annoying to me. Alright, Seth, how close are you to leveling up, brother? Like, what's up? Where are we at? Okay, 113. That's like. A couple more battles, I'm not sure. At least, a, like, three, four. Depending on what it is. Another Pidgey. Yeah, boys. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's gonna be like th three or four battles before I level up again. Um, so that was that was one. So it's gonna be two or three, depending on what I fight against. But if I can, if I fight the first guy in Brock's gym, then I might be able to advance a little bit further. Um, I'm actually gonna go try and fight him. Um, maybe. There aren't many serious Pokemon trainers here. They're all like bug catchers, but Pewter, <laughs> Pewter Jim's Brock is totally into it. Yeah, yeah. Wow, that's funny. Yeah, no wonder he's totally into the fact that they're all bug type Pokemon. I mean, uh, Pokemon trainers. He just crushes them with. I mean, he doesn't have any Rock type moves, I guess, but still. Should I go into this gym without a stab move since he doesn't have a stab move? That makes it fair, right? I think it's fair. A Diglett. Mm. Alright, so if these things have too much damage like that crit that he literally just starts off with, that's ridiculous. And I miss. Alright, yeah. Leech Seed it is, baby. We Leech Seed in it. That's, what, that's what's going on right here. I didn't mean to Leech Seed again, but it's fine. The homie doing big damage right now, and it's kind of ridiculous. Yeah, he may have Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, nice crit. Counter crit, Seth. I like it, dude. How many potions we got? Three? Alright, cool. You're not dying this fight, baby. Definitely not. And we're not gonna fight Brock until we are ready. Ready. Another... This man critting back to back. He's gonna, like, wreck me if he crit... Oh! My boy Seth coming through. With the crit! Literally with the crit. Finally, dude, that stab, dude, like, watch this. Watch what's gonna happen. Watch this guy melt. Watch it. It might be physical, so it might not count. Oh, he almost melted. Does he not get absorbed? I think he only gets, um, maybe Mega Drain, even? I don't, I don't know what, I, I, I actually don't know anything about, um, anything about, the only thing I know about Gen 1 is what that trainer just said right there. The end, at the end of that battle, that trainer said something along the lines of, um, he says, at, at the beginning of the fight, he says, you're light years away from Brock. But then he says it's a, it's a matter of distance, not time. Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he loses to us, so. Homie doesn't really understand. But it's okay. Be cool. <clears throat> Hi right, Brock, I'm coming for you. I got a stab move. Level 13. Mm. I'm gonna come smack that ass. I'm gonna smack it with a bond whip. I'm gonna whip that ass. Whipping it. Uh oh, here we go, boys. First gem battle of Gen 1 right here. Episode 2. Let's go, boys. Our boy Seth versus the world. That was a super effective song. Level 14, boys. We are now the same level as the Onyx. With the stab move. He even crit. Only did 10 points of damage. That's great. I didn't even crit. Dead. Literally just dead. Two two levels in one battle. Oh, I I I. So we get a gym. <clears throat> Sorry. I took you for granted. As proof of your victory, here is the Boulder Badge. Oh, and there it is. There it is, right up there. You guys see it? Oh, my bad. Sorry. The beautiful Boulder Badge looks so good. Psycho received the Boulder Badge. That is an official Pokemon League badge. It. Bearers Pokemon become more powerful. The technique flash can now be used at any time. I received $1,386 as well as TM34. TM that technique can be taught to a Pokemon. A TM is only good once though in this generation. Whenever we get further on, they'll somehow figure out how to make different TMs that aren't bide. 
because buy it is ass, actually. All right, so now that we have our first gym, <clears throat> supposedly our Pokemon are going to get stronger. But I know of one specific Pokemon that's going to evolve in, like, now. So, let's get to it, boys. Feels, feels, feels really good to have a badge under my belt already, you know? Episode 2, let's go. Alright, come on, girl. You looked at me, didn't you? I mean, I guess I was walking in your direction. You could have easily looked at me, though, Miss Lass. All right, boys, level 16, here we come. A crit? Dude, he's trying to get there. He says, bro, I want to become an Ivysaur as soon as possible. That's wild. Okay, so flying isn't necessarily super effective against grass in Gen 1, but grass is definitely not very effective against flying in Gen 1, which is totally fine with me, I, I think. Wait, hold up, girl. You gotta, uh-uh. <laughs> we ain't doing this shenanigans. You know, the Gen 1 moveset is actually crazy. Like, I hate Gen 1 movesets of all Pokemon, but, like, the potential that all the moves have is actually crazy because the game was so broken. <laughs> like, Hyper Beam, if you kill the target, it just free recharge. Just keep killing people. Um, what else is there? Oh, yeah, the Fire Spin and, and Constrict thing. They literally, <laughs> they just, like, can't move because they're in a Fire Spin or Constriction. I did not level up. I did not. It's okay. We're, we got it, boys. We got it. We got it. We got it. It's fine. Caterpie. Now, does grass type work on bug type? I don't think it does. Nope. Also does not. And I don't think Stab existed until Generation 2. So using Tackle here is about the same efficiency or efficacy, whatever you want to. However you want to work it out. Oh yeah, this is this is the uh, this is the run. This is the run right here, boys. Boys gonna get an Ivysaur after this battle. Pretty sure. If I don't, I'm gonna be a little butt hurt. But whatever. A crit dude Seth is looking for the evolution. He's trying to find it. He's almost there. Look, there it is, boys. Seth is becoming a man. A absolute monster. Monstrosity that is Seth. You know, I could probably do a solo run. I said earlier on episode one, not doing it. But you know what? Still not doing it. Be ridiculous. Riding on the back. Riding on the back of my fucking Ivysaur. Riding on my Ivysaur. Catching all them Bulbasaurs. What? Seth is evolving? Let's watch this super epic evolution transition or whatever you want to call it. Wow! Did you see it turn into Ivysaur? That was so fast. Wow, that, that sprite looks so good actually. I'm so happy this is like an update version in the game because that sprite looks beautiful. That youngster Joey with his little Rattata. What is that? Oh, watch this vine whip. Let's see how much damage this thing does. Ooh, do I set getting all the crits though? What is this? This man critting all day. It's crazy. I gotta count the crits. Another crit, boys! Don't forget to count the crits, dude. This is crazy. 
That was insane. How many crits am I gonna get back to back? Let's keep going. I need more crits. More crits. Alright, so I think I decided once we get once we get to Mount Moon, we might try and find a Pokemon to catch. And if we can't, then we're just gonna end the episode there. Another crit, dude. Seth is critting it. Like, literally. Critting it. No way. What is this, dude? There has to be something broken where it's landing on, like, the same roll or something. I don't know what this is. But, like, homeboy's critting out, like, so... Like, how many crits is that? I can't... I'm... I... It's gonna have something to do with the episode title, because, dude, I can't count how many crits that was. I don't even understand how I'm critting this many times. Am I gonna crit again? I don't, like, I feel like... I thought that was a crit, dude. I was about to be like, what? Alright, alright, alright. Cool. We went through two attacks. Didn't crit. We cool now. We're back to normal. RNG's back to normal now. Okay, cool. Wow. If I had crit there, he wouldn't have died. I mean, he would have died, actually, is what I meant to say. Yeah, yeah, sure thing, little bug catcher. You can get as many Pokemon as you want, sir. You're not gonna beat my critting Ivysaur. Homeboy oh, doesn't stop critting. Literally won't stop critting, and I don't know why. All right, let's see him smack a crit. I'm gonna see you smack a crit up on this Rotata. Well, I can't use Vine Whip. Oh yeah, all my crits are gone now. I'm gonna need a crit like late game when I'm like fighting blue. Nope, not gonna get it. Got all my crits now. Gotta get them later, I mean. Nice, she says. You can buy my new Pokemon. What's your new Pokemon? Is it your strongest one or is it your weakest one? Caterpie is not that new, dog. I'm so sorry to break it to you, but yikes! Alright, cool. So we're gonna leech seed and then we're gonna bind with a bunch of times. Oh, okay. That's fair. I'm, I'm probably gonna have to go back and heal, uh, just to get my, uh, my moves back. That way I can use Tackle and Vine Whip again, because I'm almost out of Vine Whips, and... Well, at least this Caterpie's dead. I'm most definitely out of Tackles, so... Alright, alright, level 18. I'm gonna get like poison powder and sleep powder and all that good stuff and stun spore. Ooh, yikes. Oh, nice. I didn't think I was gonna do enough damage to kill him in four shots, but I think I might be able to. Alright, cool. Alright, so now we're gonna go back to the PC, and, um, we're gonna heal up, maybe battle a couple trainers on the way back that we haven't fought yet. If I could run, that would be terrific, but I can't run. It's fine, though. It's fine. Alright boys, almost to Mount Moon. 
Almost there. Well, now that my Ivysaur is up and ready to go, pretty sure that a crit is due. Oh, you're just gonna disable Vine Whip like that? Guess what? That's fine. I'll just use Tackle and kill you. Easy clap. Yeah, that was literally it. Alright, boys, so we're gonna look for a Mon. If we find something that catches our eye, we'll catch it. That's not gonna catch our eye. I'm so, so very sorry. That's literally not gonna catch our eye. Probably not gonna catch my either, because that's literally like a like a poor man's Pidgey. <laughs> Sorry to break it to you, Sparrow, but you're not that cool. I mean, like you're kind of cool, but you're not that. <laughs> but like literally, you're only kind of cool. You don't, you don't have any mods, right? Don't fight. All right, all right. So what are we gonna find here? What we got? What we got? What we got? What we got? Another Sparrow. That's awesome. That's great. That means our RNG is like fixing for whenever we get that nice epic mon. It's coming. Don't worry about it. By nice and epic, I mean like not very nice and not that epic. Only a little bit of both. Already level 18. I'm battling against level 7s in the grass. That's crazy. There we go. Perfect mic placement. Get out of my face, but also where you can see it in the stream. Looks great. I right, don't want a sparrow. Already told you, boys. Don't, I'm not looking for a sparrow here. Alright, this is the last mon. Okay, Pidgey. Nope, gotta let you go, go. Sorry, bro, bro. Alright boys, well we have officially made it to Mountain Moon, which takes us to the end of episode two. At before we talk after we talk to this person. I've got six Pokeball. I've got six Pokeballs set in my belt. Sorry I had to repeat that. <laughs> at most you can carry six Pokemon. Is that it? I mean I understand that I can carry six, but right now I only need one, right? Honestly, well I don't know about honestly. Let me talk to this guy. Team Rocket attacks. Attack Cerulean Citizens. Team Rocket is always in the news. Did he just spawn there? Hello there. I've got a deal. I've got just the deal for you. I'll let you have a swell magic card for just $500. You know what? Let me get it. Let me get it. I'm gonna nickname this guy. I don't know. Magic card? What do you turn into? You turn into a giant dragon? It's not really a dragon though. He's, he's like flying in water in this generation, right? Hmm. This isn't gonna work out because he's water flying. I mean, I mean, to be fair, Gar Gyarados is a beast. So. Volsnir, that's his name, Volsnir. I'm, I don't even know what that means. I just thought about it and typed it out. Ouch, I tripped over a rocky Pokemon, Geodude. All right, so now that I have this really ratchet Volsnir that has some crazy wicked speed, holy guacamole. Um... I'm gonna train this guy off screen since we got him at a certain level that I don't think is reasonable. So, um, I'm gonna go do some switch training real quick since we made it to Mount Moon, boys. I will see you in episode three. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy this content like I do, I love myself some Pokemon content. If any, 
you know, anyone else that loves watching this stuff, let them know, because I would love to make more of this. Uh, I've got some Smash videos coming out. Uh, I plan to make WoW videos and maybe some Dark Souls. Uh, I also stream. My stream handle's right here, twitch.tv at a real psycho. Um, that's basically it, boys. I will see you all on the flip side.